Hi, my name is Matthew Gomez. I'm the writer director of The Only First Time, a short film. Uh, the Only First Time is about two teenagers, a high school couple, on their senior night of prom, and it's the night they plan to lose their virginity to one another. Um, and to me, like this is, this is a movie about really big ideas that invade really simple situations in our lives. Um, big ideas that are constantly present, like, like sex and desire and trust and vulnerability, and it's about how complicated these big ideas can make our reality. I think Lindsay and Jake have a, have a dilemma in the film that is the focal point of it. I think that, I think Lins, Lindsay's dilemma is because of the nature of her personality, because of how she distances herself intellectually from what she feels sometimes, I think she's really kind of putting all this pressure on herself about what sex is and what losing your virginity is. It's a pretty universal concept. Um, you know, it's that, uh, that loss of innocence is basically the, what I get out of it. Um, and that's something everyone has to go through at some point in time, so it's, a, it's an exciting thing to try to capture. I think we need to make the only first time right now, especially since it's a short film and not a feature film, because I think it'll give us an opportunity to show uh, the world even, I guess, uh, who we are as filmmakers. Um, and hopefully be able to be taken seriously in the future um, when facing the opportunity of making a feature film. Um, I think a short film takes your, your ideas and, and makes them smaller and you have to focus a lot more on what's actually important, like the themes and the overall message. There's a lot of things we need that cost a lot of money. Um, mostly equipment, uh, camera equipment, lighting equipment. Um, and no one's getting paid, so it's just, it's really just the equipment costs, which is the most thing that I'm concerned about. And then there's also uh, festival fees and um, post considerations. But yeah, I'm most concerned about getting the tools I need to capture the greatest images possible. As filmmakers, we can get wrapped up in the creative process and what it means to us as, like, as people who want to explore this art form. But the end game is if it doesn't get seen, there's really there's really no point to the whole process. So I think Seed and Spark really keeps that in mind and, and that's why I really believe in this site as a, as a platform to help us.